Hello everyone, Marcus Crawford with the Idaho Quadcopter Channel here. A shout out to drone enthusiasts everywhere. And as always, a shout out to all of my friends at the Drone Seekers. This drone looking vehicle, vertical takeoff and landing vehicle, uh, that you're looking at is a collaboration between Hyundai and Uber. It's uh, one of the neat things that I got to see, or at least a mock-up of, at CES 2020. This is kind of Uber's uh, total mobility solution uh, for getting moving people around and I suppose goods too. Uh, but the what they intend to do is you would pick up an Uber, ground-based Uber at your starting point, you would go to a hub, get in one of these uh, air vehicles, take you to whatever your next location, another hub, and then you would get in another ground-based vehicle and go to whatever your end destination be, whether that was an airport for going to another city or just across town going to another place in town. What follows here is what I got to see at CES 2020. So when we talk about the future of transportation, Uber and Hyundai are collaborating on an aerial vehicle. And this is it right here. Uh, so, like I said, when we talk about why the FAA is concerned with tracking our drones, that's one of the reasons, because these kind of things are going to be in the sky all around us and above us. This, I presume, is one of Hyundai's uh, transportation capsules. I don't know precisely. Here's the picture of the transportation capsule we were talking about on the I wall. Say uh, what? This isn't the ultimate uh, drone. I don't know what is. And like I said, collaboration with uh, Hyundai and Uber. Yeah, so that's an autonomous vehicle. So what we were looking at earlier was a ton autonomous module. And you can see then uh, the Hyundai Uber uh, drone capsule, if you will. Lands at the transportation hub. front of this thing. So it's coming folks, whether uh, whether you think it should or not, it's coming and it's going to be here sooner than you think. So if you look at these pods, it's uh, pretty clear that it's vertical takeoff and landing, and then VTOL, and then uh, that it uh, converts to a conventional uh, aircraft style from getting from point A to point B. Personally, I love this stuff. I can't wait.
There's the digital future, folks. We're all going to be zombies. Well, that's about it. This is Marcus Crawford with the Idaho Quadcopter Channel out. 
And if you like this kind of content, please consider subscribing to my channel. But most of all, I appreciate you taking the time to look at this video. And hey, we will see you on the next one. Thank you, folks.